Hello and welcome. Thank you for being here. My name is Allison Morgan and I am your child's seventh grade science teacher. A little bit about me. Um, I am a former Bulldog myself. I attended Washington Middle School back in the day and I do have three children of my own currently attending through the Olympia School District. All right. Um, uh, what we will be covering this year in seventh grade science, it's, it's really a introduction to chemistry and physics. Um, the focus question for this year in seventh grade is how does energy and matter interact in our world? And we do use a curriculum called FOSS, which stands for Full Option Science System. FOSS is a really fantastic um, curriculum that is engaging and not only provides students an opportunity to explore um, science hands-on in a, in a traditional classroom setting, but also through a um, fantastic um, supplement with their um, online simulations that would be similar to what they would experience in the classroom only uh, digitally. All right, our course goals this year, you can see the timeline I have in the table below. Um, hopefully we can get through all four main units. Um, this is a next generation science standard based aligned course. Um, we are beginning the year with chemical interactions. Uh, right now we are finishing up investigation one and we are moving on to investigation two in chemical interactions, which is one of my personal favorites, which covers um, an introduction to the periodic table of elements. Um, and then after we are finished going through this unit, we'll move on to weather and climate. And then from there, electromagnetic force and waves. All right, grades. Grades can be found in two places. Start at Schoology, and um, that would be the most current um, view of grades. And then I would recommend weekly checking Skyward to see how those Schoology grades have been synced with Skyward. Daily work is worth 80%. Um, daily work would be um, assignments and effort, and then 20% of your child's grade will be reflected through assessments. All right, here's a look at our Schoology page. Uh, you can see below there are some buttons that are all hyperlinked. Uh, the first one is classroom information where you can click on that and see my course syllabus in addition to some other um, helpful information. I have a hyperlink to my email and the, the Zoom link right there in the middle. Everything's just a click away. Uh, the unit folders and assignments can also be found here on this hyperlink button, but also in this area right here where it says materials. Um, all course work and uh, teacher notes can be found in the materials folder um, to help supplement and support your child as they are making their way through my course. Here's a more kind of zeroed in look at the folders that I'm talking about. Um, currently we are on the green uh, folder, Chemical Interactions Investigation 1. We are wrapping up our uh, mystery mixture um, online simulation uh, lab. And as I said earlier, we will be moving on to the periodic table. Students are also um, always welcome and encouraged to redo, um, improve, and um, complete any assignments that have been um, past their due date. Expectations in Zoom. I love seeing students in Zoom and their smiling faces. Um, there are multiple ways we can engage and interact with each other through chat, through breakout rooms. Um, I quite often will share my screen and work our way through um, the daily assignments. Um, it's just a fantastic uh, way to connect as a class and um, I hope to see them each day. All right, and how to help your student. Um, really, um, the first stop to any questions that you might have would be Schoology. I have a daily agenda posted in the upcoming uh, tab and then um, all other supplemental resources in the materials folder. And finally, um, one thing I wanna convey with you before I leave, with, leave you today is um, how thankful I am to have this opportunity to be your, your child's science teacher and share my love of science with them. Um, please contact me through email. That's really the best way to contact me. Um, I do have office hours listed here 
Um, however, if there's a time that would work better for you, I'm willing to work with you and find a time where we can all connect. Um, and I just, I'm really looking forward to a fantastic year and getting to know your child better throughout the 2021 school year. Thank you so much for being here today.